NDIP, Unit A, Element 3.2, The Enforcement of Health and Safety Law. So you now understand the legal requirements contained in the Health and Safety at Work Act and the Management of Health and Safety at Work regulations. But what if these requirements are not met? How is the law enforced and what are the options for enforcement action? Responsibilities for enforcement are divided between health and safety executive and local authorities depending on the type of workplace. As you might expect, enforcing authorities and their inspectors need to have the power to carry out their duties effectively, and this includes being able to gain entry to premises and carrying out whatever examination, investigation or interviews deem necessary. However, these wide-reaching powers are qualified by the principle of enforcement set out in the HSE's Enforcement Policy Statement to make sure that enforcement action is proportional to the breach and consistently applied. If enforcement action is necessary, it can range from prosecution and formal cautions to the use of enforcement notices, improvement and prohibition notices. So let's look at the course notes now to find out more detail about enforcement action, their implications and, if necessary, appeal procedures.